Thing down. Thing down. Down. I'm not gonna lie, I was as nervous as hell. <laughs> <laughs> when you dial in and zoom into this kind of animal, he looked way bigger than what I expected. Way bigger. And to see him so soon, it was like all or nothing moment. We couldn't, we didn't have a chance to actually think this through. But uh, he's down and he looks magnificent. Eh? Really, absolute beast. Okay, well, let's go have a look. Thanks, Sean. Yes, what a beauty. Look how hard he is. Eh? That's an awesome. Thanks, John. No trick. Yes. Awesome. Boy. Well, Mark, here it is. What Thank do you think you. of your lecture? Oh, it's a huge, huge surprise, eh? Did not expect this size animal. And it's the first one we saw. So the pressure was on. <laughs> um, I mean, beautiful setting. We've got this dam across the way. And uh, for him to be sitting nicely, settled, I was really nervous I'd miss the shot. But fortunately, we made it. And here he is, looking yeah. fantastic. You shot well. And uh, it's a beautiful specimen. No, he's wide, he's got everything, he's got hooks. So he's in yes. such good condition. It's absolutely. And absolutely. Um, the coloration, absolutely beautiful animal. And I think you can be very proud of it. Very proud, also considering the fact that it's free range. You never know what you're going to get. Yeah, and um, yeah. I prefer luck sometimes over skill. And <laughs> to me, this was just a lucky day. So yes, absolutely. Awesome. So thank you very, very much. No, it's Appreciate a pleasure. It. So this is one of our favorite spots here in the Eastern Cape. Uh, we often come this way to look for fellow deer. And uh, we have been noticing the lechery moving around through the property. And uh, my friend Mark over here, when he saw that I'd shot the bull, said, oh, he definitely wants one as well. And uh, so we made a plan and we came out here looking for the lechery. We saw a couple of fellow deer this morning and uh, we decided, no, it's time for, for the lechery bull. And uh, as we entered the camp, we saw this bull bedded down, managed to get within 200 yards, and uh, Mark made an excellent shot with your 6.5. 6.5. 6 I don't mention it's my wife's rifle, because she lays claim to that rifle. <laughs> so I'd ask nicely to use it. Yeah, but it performed beautifully. Yes, it did. And uh, we managed to bag this uh, beautiful bull, mature bull, with such beautiful coloration. And um, yeah, it's a, it's a once in a lifetime. You don't shoot these every day. No, you don't. It's not something you come across. And, and they're quite scarce. It's not no. often you'll come across something like this. Absolutely. Uh, definitely a bucket list uh, item. And uh, I'm sure it'll be absolutely stunning on your wall. Absolutely.